I think it was our second period. We we talked a little bit in the room that okay, it's time it's time to play a little harder. We got away from that a little bit. Uh, a couple of games play didn't play that hard, so it was time to to start playing harder. And I think that's what we did starting in the second period and uh, got the good win. Look at what Vladimir Tarasenko was able to do. Obviously, usually it takes a couple games, but already a two-goal game here in game number two. Do you feel like there's already some early chemistry building between you guys? Well, with the players I'm playing right now and even before, like it's it's easy to to adjust with the, those type of guys. And uh, obviously, like Rhino, Rhino is an amazing player, really smart player. So it's always easy with that guy. And then Vladdy, he's he can score, he can make plays, he can. He's very, very dangerous player when he has the puck on, the, on his stick or even without the puck. So uh, playing with those two guys, it's always uh, going to try and be as dangerous as possible. I mean, it seemed like tonight especially, like you guys were clicking and he was really making those reads in both ends of the ice, and especially on his first goal where he made the, uh, the interception there. I mean, how special of a player is he to kind of add to that one right now? Well, I think everyone everyone knows what kind of how special player he is. Like how he's been in the league for what like 10, 11 years, and every year he's he's been one of those highest goal scorers. He he makes plays, he scores goals, he has an unreal unreal shot. So to have a, that type of guy on the ice is always dangerous. And uh, obviously, like. I'm playing with him, so I'm trying to trying to get the puck to him and trying to get open. Did you expect the chemistry to kind of click back quickly? It's been two games, and even the first one, it looks like you guys were finding each other pretty much every time you're on the ice. Yeah, he's he's actually that type of guy who came in and he just started talking right away. He wants to find out like what what we're doing here, what we want to accomplish, and like what kind of plays we're making. So uh, when when you have a guy like that coming in and trying to find out everything, he reads the game really well. So. It's it's gonna happen quicker than than with the guy who doesn't doesn't ask questions and doesn't doesn't find out how we play. You talked about you said Sam Reinhardt's a real smart player. How does that translate into when you're playing with him? What does that mean for you on the ice? He's making those reads. Like obviously, I'm I'm the centerman, so I'm trying to be all over the place. And when, for example, I, I get caught like offensively, he's gonna be there for me defensively and vice versa so he knows he knows where to go on the ice he knows the next two three three steps what's going to happen on the ice he can he always makes the right play and like he's reliable defensively offensively and he can do it all he made the right pass to you i guess today too right? <laughs> yeah i mean that that was a nice pass uh just had to put it in in the net thanks, thanks, thanks thank you, thank you.